Yo, what's good, YouTube? Guess who? Yep, Hectic Reacts bring you guys a video, and um, just wanna uh talk about what this game was. Um, my 15 game winning streak was on the line, and when I started this game, I was in the chat with Brown Paper Bag, and I was like, you know, I really shouldn't have started this game. I felt like it was a trap. I haven't played the Texans in a while, and JJ Watch is a monster. You know, you can basically rush one person the whole game and still get elite pressure with JJ Watt. I mean, his block shed is crazy, and I didn't feel like getting my ball swatted, and right there, you know, made a bad read in the corner, but, you know, I kind of expected that. You know, those corner routes, if you throw them late, it's either a swat or a pick every time, most of the time a pick, and the guy I was playing was pretty good. His name was G-Bill Gunna 5 or something, you know, pretty cool dude, you know, and right here, he just hits me like two straight okie dokes. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, he kind of, he kind of did me in right there. You know, rolling with the Texans, and, you know, people who usually get the Texans just try to throw it deep to Andre Johnson, not really focusing that they have two really good running backs. Not him, he utilized them in the passing game and the running game, respectively. And that was kind of hard. His defense, mostly it was max coverage defense, you know, not rushing too many people. At most, he rushed three at a time, rarely ever more than three, and he would just play man coverage in the secondary, pass commit drop zones and rush JJ Watt and he'll get pressure like that and that's one of the things about some of these teams like the Niners the Texans and sometimes the Ravens like you don't have to rush too many people to get pretty good pressure and I'm pretty sure he knew that second and go from the five and he's throwing the ball away I'm trying to make a goal line stand trying to make him take a field goal if anything you know third and go from the five he's looking I don't think he finds anybody and he decides you know I'm gonna just throw it anyway. So fourth and go from the four. You know, like a lot of people online, they don't really like to take their points. So he's going for it. And right here, he tries to make a run for it with Shaw. But me and Mc McAfee ain't having that. McPhee, Nanny McPhee, whatever his name is. So I'll get the ball back in my own territory. You know, he's stopping the run. Third and seven. I said, screw it. I'm running the draw. And th there we go. Ray Rice breaks the tackle. And now we're in business. You see? Didn't want to risk throwing interception that close to my goal line. And right here, got a nice wheel route with Dennis Pitta. And, you know, trying to trying to keep running with uh, Ray Rice. Um, yeah, the Texas defense is tough. Look at this two-man rush. Look at J.J. Watt just break. Look at that. Rewind this video and look at that play again. J.J. Watt just destroyed my whole offensive line. You know, now it's third and 20. And I'm throwing it deep. Get on. I finally break the defense and Flacco throws the ball to no man's land like a freaking idiot. And that hurt real bad. So now I'm I'm getting my two-man rush on, getting no type of pressure. And he just throws on the run. I didn't know Matt Shop could throw on the run, you know, elitely. And right there, I get a nice pick with Ray Lewis before halftime to stop him from scoring. And this game kind of went by real fast, you know. The video, the raw video was only 39 minutes, which is kind of rare for a Madden video. You know, a full-length Madden video is usually 45 minutes to an hour. And look at Ray Rice doing work. Got the ball at a halftime. Work. Work. Yeah, so. Um. Yeah, it's great. Great stuff. Great stuff. So, this morning when I woke up, I looked in my sub box and I saw a Madden Moment 7 video. And I went berserk. You know, I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh, Madden Moment 7 uploaded. Let's go. You know, Madden Moment 7 is one of my favorite commentators. I don't really care what anybody says. Some people don't like him. Some people do. I mean, I love me some Madden Moment 7. He goes up top. Ray Lewis drops a pick. Fourth and seven from the 43. He's looking. And he tries a corner route. Throws it late and I get it. But Madden Moment 7 is one of my favorite commentators. Hands down. And I really enjoy his videos. And he, he hasn't uploaded in three months. And so when I saw it, I was like, thank you. Okay, look at this JJ Watt just coming off the edge. And... Freaking Cody is a beast too. This whole D line's a beast. You know, Connor Barwin. They're basically he he put the linebackers at linebacker pass rush, and he was just getting pressure with this freaking max coverage fag D. It, it was just painful. You know, that's like the ultimate thing. And speaking of you know, like the ultimate cheese in this game, I really wish EA didn't make ha give you the opportunity to make custom playbooks because. Custom playbooks are just complete cheese. Like, uh, offense especially. Like, you can basically add all the money plays and money formations in one playbook and just destroy people with it. And 
you know, I've been playing dudes like that. Like, obviously, Heavy Panther, you know, the Triple Option, Read Option, uh, Full House, Strong Clothes, you know, the, the Bunch Quads from Philly's Playbook. I've seen it all in one playbook. And people are just killing this game. And I'm like, oh, my God. You know, EA, that wasn't one of their smartest ideas. They, you know, they don't take account that not everybody's going to play on normal franchise mode and do this. No, people are going online and raping people with it. And look at freaking Ladarius freaking Webb getting a clutch interception against Andre Johnson. So now, 14-7, four minutes left. I need something. You know, he's still, he's still coming with that three-man rush, two-man rush. And look at Jacoby Jones, man. Burn out, but freaking Daniel Manny. It's like a hundred speed catches me, and I'm feeling terrible. I'm like, come on, I need to get in the end zone. I haven't been able to do anything against this man this whole game. You know, I'm looking, and I see Square and Quan Bolden. I'm trying to drive first and go from the four, and running the ball with Ray Rice, trying to get it in. Second and go from the one, try QB sneak, don't get it. Third and go from the one, try it again and get it. So now it's a tie game, finally. And long time no see. Time, <laughs> digits on the scoreboard are the same. You know, this is actually one of the few defensive games I've played in Madden this year. Normally games, you know, 30 points each and everything. You know, it, it's kind of hard to lock up defensively. But I guess defense has stepped up in this game. A low scoring affair. It's always nice sometimes. Look at freaking Matt freaking Schaub. Oh my god, now it's the first down. I'm like, what the heck? And he calls a timeout. Uh, 46 seconds left in the game. I knocked the ball down. You know, right here, second and 10. He throws it deep. I smashed the swap button, but Kerry Williams wouldn't give me a freaking animation. And now I'm down. And I'm like, oh my god, why? Why is this happening? I got 39 seconds and two timeouts to make something out of nothing. And I'm not... I'm like, crap, man. This isn't great. No. So, yeah. And so, I'm trying to take a kickback with Jacoby. I'm like, please, give me anything right now. I'll take anything. Nothing. So, here we go on offense. You already know. One man rush. I'm looking. I throw it up to Tandon Dawes. Great, 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 great reception. Call a timeout. I'm at the 47. Basically, got midfield. I'm looking. And I don't. My clock management was pretty poor. I, I held the ball for too long in the pocket. I should have thrown it away by now. But I end up finding a Torrey Smith. Call another timeout. 17 seconds left. I'm looking. Throw it up. Oh, my God. That would have been so crucial. And right here, 12 seconds left. I'm looking. And I throw it. And I get tackled in bounds. And, guys, that's the game. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Rate, comment, subscribe, guys. Just pulled up to 800 subs. I really appreciate it, guys. I love y'all. Peace. Have a great day.